keep it secret, it's different bills. Hey, don't go dim it, you need it, I got it listed, yeah. You wanna make it, I'll show you just how to make it, yeah. I got all the rarest bills, and I ain't done, yeah. I'm from the finish to making bills like a prospect. Flow space and slashes to catching us with a lot threat. You keep the medals, cause the real ones coming up next. Only scratch the surface, still they try to drag my name in dirt, they try to bring me down. See me when you ain't like Yo, what's good, my nephews and nieces? This is your favorite uncle, Uncle Demi, and today I have another special banger for you, all right? Today we have Antoine Cars replica build. Now, before we get into the video, though, make sure you drop a like and subscribe as liking up the video puts the video to recommend it. And of course, subscribe and put your noti game for my daily double uploads. But now let's hop straight into this video. So the replica build is called Big Dog. I really, really, really think this is a dope name. And the build itself is actually really good and unique from how we've seen a lot of replica builds and just builds in the park in general. So this could be fun because you're just not going to see anything like this in the park, okay? So if you don't know who Antoine Carr is, he did make a really good career when he played with the Cleveland Cavaliers um, I actually had his Mitchell and that throwback jersey back when it was like that you know that brownish gold color throwback jersey I had that jersey it was really dope but hit that the Cleveland Cavaliers version was okay but the for some reason the Atlanta Hawks version was way much better so that's the reason why I went with the um, Atlanta Hawks version he is a power forward right-handed and number three when he was playing for the Hawks Yes, he was 55 when he was playing with the Cavs, but we're going with the Hawks, okay? So, he is 6'9", and that's where you're going to get those demigod builds. So, 6'9", already let you know he's going to be pretty dope. And then, he's 225 pounds with a 7-foot wingspan. Body shape, I went to find, but you can go with any body shape that you want, but this is the shape that I went with. It's not going to change the name. Then, we're going to go 88 on the close shot. So, by going 80 on a close shot, you will be able to get the Fearless Finisher, Fast Twitch um, on Gold, which is very important. You have a 68 driving layup, so you're not able to get um, the Dominant Big Man layup package or anything like that. So, you're just going with the basic layup package, which is straight. Same thing here, you only get a 73. So, as you can see, the attributes are literally two off on both for 70 and 75, respectfully. So, you're not able to get... Giannis dunk package or anything like that so it's all good though because really what this build is is a post score you get to go 97 with the standing dunk so do not sleep on a 97 standing dunk you will get rise up on gold we're going to utilize that and then the post control is an 83 so again you'll be able to get the hall of fame post band technician gold back down punisher dream shaker drop stepper respectfully and their tier one badges because he's 6'9 so that's pretty dope now we're absolutely going to destroy the game with a 91 mid-range jump shot so this is, means also post fades it's going to be 91 it's going to be a foot right in front of three point line is a 91 you get blinders on gold hall of fame green machine i mean anything and everything that you will want from a post score and a mid-range jump shooter you're going to get and it's at a high rate and this is what i'm saying which is pretty unique because it has a high standing dunk, a high close shot, post control, and a mid range. Doesn't have a high layup or driving dunk, so you know a lot of this, a lot of this build will be with the back to the basket. Free throw at an 80. Do not worry about your three point shot. So again, as you see right now, we're looking at 22 and 15. Then we're actually able to get our pass accuracy to a 70, so that's a good thing. This build will actually be able to pass and a 63 on the ball handle, which doesn't really do much, but what it does do is just give you nine badge points to work with from playmaking so the pass accuracy is really what plays the most important part here and then what we're going to do here on defense we're going 78 on the um interior defense 63 on the perimeter defense we're going to go 68 on the steel 88 on the block and then we're going to go 73 on the offensive rebound and 78 on the defensive so basically what really stands out here is that you will get your anchor on silver you get chase down artists on the hall of fame you also will get your rebound chaser which is just on bronze but again this is a different type of build It's more of an offensive heavy type build okay then we're going to go 71 on the speed we'll go 66 on the acceleration the strength is an 83 so you are able to get bully on silver your vert is a 65 and of course your stamina is only can be maxed out as an 88 so regardless the build is very unique like i said you just look at these numbers if you was to see this on a chart um looking at someone's player card you'll be like wow what the heck 91 mid-range 97 standing dunk he's only 6'9 like what's going on like it's just unique build he has a very high block don't sleep on the hall of fame chase down so if you want to have a very unique name 
and a build that's unique in itself with the attributes this is definitely one to take a look at okay um you do get post scoring of course glass rim and shot creating takeover obviously i went with the advanced post moves because again it says it makes it easier to beat defenders with post spins fakes drives and clear outs i think that makes sense and then of course the post shot daggers gives a large boost to a post hook a fade up and unders and shimmies and hop shots so again that's the reason why i decided to go with this combination here i thought that would be a really really good combination to have so again if you wanted to try to get glass or rim i wouldn't recommend that but i would recommend if you're something that you want to do a pull of precision that would be a good one because it provides a significant boost to well time jump shots taking off the dribble and then of course this one right here reduces the impact of shot contests against pull-ups step backs and spin shots so again that can also work right but here you have it my nephews and nieces again like i said man very 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 unique build this is a customized one so again you're just not like one you're gonna find on the streets so you definitely got to be able to utilize this properly man and there you have it my nephews and nieces and look at that man big dog like you can't ask for anything better than that man it's actually pretty dope so now what we're gonna do is this we're gonna test this build out real quick we'll get a 99 and then we'll get you out of here so let's go here let's max this all the way out all right let's go here so again like i said ones that we really 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 want to have we want to have post spin technician we do want to have back down punisher and where is let's see fearless finisher so that is let's do fearless finisher for, for the 10. down here only thing i really want is the core rise up get your fast twitch also so these two are going to be the most important ones don't worry about posterizer don't worry about bully do not worry about aerial wizard what we can do is go back here and then your slithery finisher and then again drop stepper right so um because i can see myself doing a drop step so this can be the combination that i would work with um if you want a double core here you definitely could this would be a good candidate for double core because what you could do if you want to have more fun with it get your bully um you could also be able to get dream shake um so again there's opportunities there here what i would do is i will go with of course my green machine i will go with space creator and then i will go ahead and get my blinders so we're not able to do that off rip um so you definitely want to add at least two badge points here to get your blinders on gold that's very important so make sure you do that and you still will have seven badges left over and then having those seven badges left over i would go with amped because again you will be paint mashing a lot and then of course mini musicians another good one volume shooter so again you have options there here what i would do is i will go core vice grip and then i will get obviously get where is quick first step but where is break start okay we'll get our break starter definitely need that just in case you are working there right? and then what else will we use here we don't need bell out um post playmaker yeah that's pretty good to use um uh, that's a tier one badge and dimer we can use dimer also so yeah we'll do something like this because this build will be in the post and then here we want to get our chase down we definitely want to get our workhorse um that's nine let's get our box out and then come down here what we really want to get i think anchor is going to be the highest one so we'll core anchor we'll get rebound chaser and then we'll come back up here we'll get our box out and we'll get let me see um glove post lockdown um menace and then let's go let me see post lockdown and i don't know off ball pass it's really hard to pick this other stuff we don't have a lot of badges for but anyway there you have it my nephews and nieces this is the setup hopefully you enjoyed the video if you did just make sure you drop a like you subscribe to this uh, channel and other than that this is your favorite old head uncle demi i'll be back really really soon with another banger man you know when i say back to another banger you know exactly what i'm talking about i'm talking about tomorrow man i'm out